Hello friends, welcome to Technique. This is Nirmal here and in this video, we're going to do a detailed comparison of the Honor 8X with the Redmi Note 6 Pro. So both these devices are priced below the 15K price segment with the Honor 8X priced at 14 rupees for the 4GB RAM and 64GB storage and this device comes with a Kirin 710 octa-core chipset and a pretty good overall package. Now the Redmi Note 6 Pro is priced starting at 13 rupees for the 4GB RAM and 64GB storage variant and this device comes with the Snapdragon 636 octa-core chipset. Now both the phones have Android 8.1 audio and their custom UIs. One comes with EMUI, the other one has the MIUI 10. So let's find out which is the better device out of these two devices in the sub 15k price segment. So let's get started. First step, let's have a look at the design and build quality. So looking at the design aspect, uh, the Honor 8X is made of uh, metal and glass. It's an aluminium chassis with uh, the glass finishing. And you can see that uh, there is a two layer glass finish, which gives it a really great feel altogether. The Honor 8X is definitely one of the best looking smartphones out there with the glass finishing. And it looks really nice uh, in terms of the build quality as well. Now, on the other hand, the Redmi Note 6 Pro comes with a metal construction. We have a, a metal back panel with uh, the top and bottom panel finished in plastic. It has uh, almost the same looks as the Redmi Note 5 Pro and the Mi A2. But uh, on the other hand, uh, the uh, Honor 8X brings in a new refreshing design with the glass finishing. So overall, in terms of the design and build quality, our choice would be the Honor 8X with a refreshing glass and a metal construction and feels really premium for the sub 15K price segment. Now moving on to the display. Now both the phones have a Full HD Plus resolution display with a notch. The Honor 8X has a 6.5 inches uh, Full HD Plus resolution display with an LTPS uh, LCD panel and this has a smaller notch. On the other hand, we have IPS LCD panel with a 6.26 inches screen size with a larger notch. Now the display quality looks pretty good on both the phones. Both are Full HD Plus resolution displays but you can see uh, that uh, at uh, almost same brightness levels, uh, we can see that the Honor 8X display feels slightly more uh, better and vibrant and colorful and overall uh, the quality looks slightly better on the Honor 8X. So our choice in terms of the display quality would be the Honor 8X. Uh, another reason is that it has smaller notch and uh, the bezels uh, are lesser and also you can see the chin of uh, the device it looks really nice because of the lesser bezels. On the other hand you can see the Redmi Note 6 Pro with larger bezels at the bottom and also on the sides. And the notch is you can see the notch uh, is definitely better on the Honor 8X with smaller notch. On the other hand the redmi note 6 pro has a wider notch so that's the honor 8x and the redmi note 6 pro in terms of the display quality and our pick would be the honor 8x now next up let's talk about the software so both the phones are powered by android 8.1 oreo out of the box now we have two custom uis uh, we have emui and miui so here we would say we leave it to your views to decide which is the better UI out of these two devices. Both are really good and offer a lot of customizations. We have uh, the EMUI with uh, additional tools including ride mode, simple mode. Then we have option to customize uh, with gestures. There is option for um, one handed UI motion control. Then dual app support is there and app lock via fingerprint scanner and a lot of additional options are included. On the other hand, the MIUI 10 also offers a plethora of modes including dual apps uh, support, app lock is included then second space and a whole lot of features are included but when you look at the features being offered we feel the emui has uh, a bit more features additional features to offer than the miui 10 so uh, probably uh, if you like a lot of customizations then emui probably would be a slightly better choice but having said that both are pretty good in terms of the performance and uh, both offer a lot of customizations now talking about the performance so the Honor 8X is powered by the Kirin 710 octa-core chipset which is uh, having 4GB RAM as well as 6GB RAM variants. On the other hand, the Redmi Note 6 Pro is powered by the Snapdragon 636 again with 4GB RAM and 6GB uh, uh, RAM is offered. Now looking at the benchmark score of these two devices, you can see that the Kirin 710 is a bit more powerful than the Snapdragon 636 and Kirin 710 is closer to the Snapdragon 660 in terms of the performance as well. So you can see that uh, it is more powerful than the Redmi Note 6 Pro in terms of the overall performance. Now looking at the day-to-day -day performance, you can see that both these devices are really good. Uh, both have really great performance overall. Now when it comes to gaming, that's where uh, the Honor uh, 8X with the Kirin 710 makes the difference because it is a bit more powerful. And if you're a person who plays PUBG Mobile a lot, the Honor 8X offers the option of HD graphics and uh, also high frame rate. 
On the other hand, uh, the Redmi Note 6 Pro does not offer high frame rate. So if you are more into PUBG uh, gaming, uh, the Honor 8X uh, makes slightly better choice because it has a larger display, 6.5 inches display and you get a higher frame rate uh, available. On the other hand, uh, the Redmi Note 6 Pro does not offer that. Now talking about the other aspect, the fingerprint scanner on both these devices are available on the back panel. There is face unlock on both the phones and both are quite uh, similar in terms of the performance axis. Now additionally, uh, both these devices offer dual SIM cards and uh, dual voltage support. And uh, here we have an additional option now that is a dedicated SD card slot is offered on the Honor 8X while uh, it's a hybrid slot on the Redmi Note 6 Pro. Now let's move on to the cameras. So we have a dual camera setup on both the phones. We have a 20 megapixel primary camera, S1.8 aperture, secondary 2 megapixel camera for depth sensing, LED flash, and on the other hand, the Redmi Note 6 Pro comes with a 12 megapixel shooter with S1.9 aperture, and we have a secondary 5 megapixel camera for depth sensing again with LED flash. On the front panel, we have a 16 megapixel shooter uh, with f 2.0 aperture on the Honor 8X while we have a dual camera setup with a 20 megapixel shooter of primary camera and a 2 megapixel secondary camera on the Redmi Note 6 Pro. Now let's have a look at uh, the camera samples we are taken with these two devices. So in terms of daylight conditions, you can see that both these devices offer great details. The colors are vibrant and colorful on uh, uh, the Honor 8X and offer slightly more details and the shadows are resolved slightly better on the Honor 8X. On the other hand, um, uh, colors are a bit more natural on the Redmi Note 6 Pro and uh, provides great details as well. So in terms of daylight conditions, uh, we can say that both these devices are neck to neck. No major difference uh, in terms of the performance, both uh, offer great camera abilities. Even in close-up images, both offer great details, great sharpness levels. And when it comes to portrait mode, that's where uh, the Redmi Note 6 Pro has a slight advantage uh, over the Honor 8X. Now, looking at the low light uh, captures, this is one area where uh, the Honor 8X has an advantage because it has a 1.8 aperture compared to the 1.9 aperture on the Redmi Note 6 Pro. And also there is a dedicated night mode available on the Honor 8X, which provides slightly better details in extreme low light conditions when compared to the Redmi Note 6 Pro. Now, talking about the selfie camera, uh, both the devices are again uh, pretty good in terms of selfie performance as well. Good details, good color reproduction, but again uh, portrait selfies, uh, the Redmi Note 6 Pro is the better choice. Now video recording is pretty good on both the phones. Uh, uh, the Honor 8X does not offer EIS while uh, uh, the Redmi Note 6 Pro offers EIS. Both are limited to 1080p resolution. So in terms of the camera performance, we feel uh, uh, there is no clear winner. Both are really good camera performers in this price segment. Now moving on to the battery. So we have a 3750 mAh capacity battery on the Honor 8X while uh, we have a 4000 mAh capacity battery on the Redmi Note 6 Pro. When we reviewed the Honor 8X, we found the battery to be really capable and we got almost close to 8 hours of screen on time on Honor 8X. On the other hand, uh, the Redmi Note 6 Pro has a slight edge in terms of the battery performance because it's a slightly higher capacity battery, but not by a huge margin, almost 8 to 8 and a half hours uh, on the Redmi Note 6 Pro as well. So battery is neck to neck, but uh, there is a slight advantage for the Redmi Note 6 Pro. So that was a detailed comparison of the Redmi Note 6 Pro with the Honor 8X. So which is a better device to buy? Now the Honor 8X is priced 14 triple nine for the base variant, while uh, the Redmi Note 6 Pro is priced 13 triple nine. So which is better here? So if you ask us our opinion, we would pick the Honor 8X, and we'll list out the reasons why. So the Honor 8X has better design and better build quality, and also larger display and a slightly vibrant display. Apart from that, the EMUI is slightly feature rich than the MIUI 10, not by a huge margin though. And the performance aspect, the Kirin 710 outperforms the Snapdragon 636 and the gaming experience uh, with a larger display feels better. And the camera experience is quite similar on both the phones. In, if you look at the overall value for money aspect, even if you are spending 1k additional on the Honor 8X, it's a good overall package and that's our choice among these two devices. The Honor 8X is available exclusively on Amazon. So that's the detailed comparison of the Honor 8X with the Redmi Note 6 Pro. Hope you enjoyed watching this video. Do hit that like button and also hit the subscribe button for more videos. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.